welcome to the Flick a Shot tutorial. Today I'm going to be sharing with you every single thing that I've developed and honed about this cool move. It's not so much the what you do, but it's the how you do it. All the little design details that come together that make something like this possible. Practice doesn't make perfect. Practice makes permanent. I'm going to teach you how to control the flight path of the card using a key principle so you can just shoot it directly from one hand to the other or you kind of arc and boomerang it in front of your body into your other hand. The key principle when it comes to shooting the card is this, stable like a table. The card only stays bold for a short period of time and then it goes and springs back up like a spring. So you'll know you got it right when you hear a really nice pop. Now the big principle is known as establishing the arc. Now what does that mean? Well, the arc is basically the flight path that the kite takes as it flies through the air. Once you learn how to set certain points, you can cause the kite to fly however you want it to fly. This is a very simple extension of that. And now that you know the whole principle behind how the arc works, all you're doing is to tweak it to allow the kite to boomerang behind your back, around your body, and into your other hand. Ugh! <sighs> 